Okay guys, just got back from Kroger and Walmart and I spent $60 at Kroger and I spent $45 at Walmart. So I was trying to stick to as close to $100 this week as I could since um, I went over, you know, a little bit more than I wanted to in prior weeks. So I think it came out to be what, 105? Like I feel like I did pretty stinking good y'all. So um, I got quite a few stock up items because I did not cook all the meals last week that I had on the meal plan. So they carried over into this week. So I didn't need a ton this week. Um, so I just took advantage of a couple coupons, got some stock up items, and I just stuck to a hundred dollar budget. Um, so I guess I could have spent $120 and stocked up even more because again, because again, I didn't need, um, really that much. So I got a few stock up items and then just got to a hundred dollars. Like I said, I guess I could have spent 120 and stocked up some more. Um, but this is everything I got for right now. Um, everything is pictured here that I bought, except I bought three boxes of soda and then also got a big 24 pack thing of water bottles for Andre so he can take one to football each day. So um, I got Honey Nut Cheerios. That's something Andre requested for breakfast this week. And then I got my Kashi Goling cereal for me this week. Um, I got some of this penne pasta because this is only 82 cents and I did not need this this week so this is just a stock up item. Um, I had a coupon, like I think it was, if you spent $15 or more, you got like $3 off for meat. Um, so I got one pound of ground turkey. Again, this, this is just a stock up item. I don't need this. I have a lot of ground turkey, a pretty good bit going right now. Um, I bought a pot roast. If y'all been watching my channel for a long time, you know I don't like to buy that much red meat and um, pot roast and things like that. I usually like a good pot roast about once every other month, and I've not made a pot roast in quite a few months. So this is not on the meal plan this week, but I'm going to put it back in our deep freeze and use it for some other week in the future. But I took advantage of that with a coupon that I had. And then in here I have some ribs because Dennis requested ribs. Again, I don't buy that that often, and he requested it, so I went on and got that. And that's all the meat that I got this week. I took advantage of that coupon just to get two special items that I don't normally always buy. And then I got some shredded, um, shredded cheese, sliced cheese, Dennis's low sodium bacon. We needed more butter. I got a half a gallon of almond milk, a half a gallon of regular milk, and then I just got a few packs of these shrimp ramen noodles. And then I have two boxes of snack cakes right there. And I got these just as a special treat we'll probably eat for dessert tonight. And these were only $1.78. They were clearanced out. And I mean, they're still really fresh. So, yeah, just when I got those, they were at Walmart. And they look very um, St. Patrick's Day-ish. But anyway, I got those. Um, Isaac requested Pop-Tarts for the week. We needed more oatmeal. We were out of oatmeal. And then I got some more... Halo mandarins, a pint of blueberries. They were a decent price this week. I got some more bananas. I got three baked potatoes. I believe one night this week we're going to be eating steak. Um, and again, that's a red meat that we normally don't ever buy. Um, so that's like a rare thing. But we got three baked potatoes. Isaac doesn't eat potatoes or baked potatoes. So we just got three for the rest of us. Um, one loaf of bread. I got a couple of packs of taco seasoning just to stock up couple packs of au jus gravy just to stock up and a couple packs of ranch just to stock up and then I got these chipotle pepper um, seasonings for the steak I really like this as a marinade and then I got one Montreal steak I have another one of these on hand I figured Dennis might could use those with his ribs I got a dozen eggs um, a jar of pizza sauce just to have on hand a stock up item we don't need this week salsa just as a stock up item and then I got uh, two large tomato sauce, two small cans of tomato sauce, sauce, all for on hand because I won't be using those this week. One can of Sloppy Joe sauce just to stock up. A jar of spaghetti sauce just to stock up. And pepperoncinis because we were all out. Um, I normally do not buy these like single serve containers of mac and cheese. Um, but I decided the only reason I was going to get these this week is since Isaac does not eat baked potatoes. He's not going to, you know, have that side item with his steak. So I was going to get him just one single mac and cheese. But I said, you know what, let me just go on and get a pack of four. Because I don't know if once the um, other guys in the house see the mac and cheese, if they necessarily want the baked potatoes or not. 
maybe they want both I don't know so I just went on and got those um, and then I got a variety thing of chips and that is everything guys so again I, we didn't need a ton this week and I got quite a few stock up items and still stuck to right at around a hundred dollars this week so I'm very excited about that amount and I feel pretty good about this haul. So as always, I will leave the link down below to online grocery pickup at Walmart. Click that link. It'll save you $10 off of your first grocery order. And please comment, like, subscribe, and share. And I will see you guys next week for the next one. Bye.